parametric graphing. So we'll head straight off into graph and table. And our first job is to change the type to parametric. Uh, from there, we could have chosen XT uh, from the sort of drop down menu, but type works just as well for us. Now, we'll need the keyboard up here. The first function for the X part is T squared on 100. So here we go. Uh, if we head down to math, two here's a t in the corner or we could have gone to variables as well math two menu here we go t upstairs we want it squared to the power of two and downstairs is 100 and uh for the y part of this function we want a t upstairs and downstairs 10 and we tap execute or make sure you tick the box to select it and let's have a look at what it looks like. So we'll tap the draw graph icon and here it goes. And if we zoom out um, with the minus key and zoom out, you can see it's heading off. Now let's zoom back in and zoom back in. So here's our default graph. Now to change the scale for this type of graphing, when we hit on the view window here and head down to the bottom, you can see here are the parameters that we can change. So let's change them from going from negative 25 on our t value maybe up to positive 15 and steps of one and so we'll tap ok and see and you can see now we just get this section of the graph and when i start tracing uh class pad comes in when t is negative 25 down here and as we tap to the right with the cursor t is incrementing up in steps of one here um, and it'll go all the way up until t reaches 15, the uh, maximum that we set. You'll notice on this type of graphing that g solve is pretty useless. Most of the functions here are actually grayed out. Sketch is still kind of useful. Let's do the tangent at a point now. Um, when we come to choose where we want to draw it, we actually can't put in the x coefficient, but we can put in... Um, the t value so let's have a guess at when t is 10 so here we go if i start typing the t value as 10 rather than the x coordinate note it's the t uh, the parameter t that we actually set when i tap ok that's up at the point when x is 1 1 and we could have worked that out from here when uh, t is 10 y is going to be 1 uh, and now i tap execute and class bad draws in the tangent and gives us the equation of it